Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another daily vlog. Today is Friday, feeling good. It's about 11 a.m. I'm currently in my car right now because I'm actually about to head to a content shoot. Kaylin has just run into one of our favorite coffee shops near our old apartment actually to get coffees because this is where the studio that we're doing a content day is at. Uh, we're meeting Lexi and our other friend Nat there. So I just thought I would bring you guys along today. I'm sorry if you can hear my aircon. Sorry, I just turned my aircon down because it might have been too loud. But yeah, I just thought I'd bring you guys along. I haven't vlogged in a couple of days and I really want to keep vlogging every day. I love daily vlogging right now. Um, also, speaking of, speaking of, I've started daily vlogging on TikTok. So I'm trying to post a vlog every single day on TikTok. So that one's a little bit more raw and less curated than I'd say YouTube is. Um, just because like it's always on my phone. I literally am always taking videos on my phone. So yeah, it's definitely, it's been a lot, but I'm actually having so much fun on TikTok. I feel like I finally have found my vibe on TikTok. I was never like a dancer or I didn't really enjoy doing the other things that I used to post on TikTok. It wasn't really me. So I'm really happy that I have found my vibe on TikTok and I post daily vlogs now. So if you guys want to follow me on it on TikTok, I think it's just Madison underscore Wooly. So make sure you guys follow me for everyday vlogs. Also, I do have some really exciting news for when we get back to the apartment later today. Our coffee table finally arrived. So I'm gonna do a updated apartment show around, not the official apartment tour because I still have a little bit more that I wanna do, but I'm gonna show you guys pretty much the finished apartment updates. Um, and I also wanna go buy a new TV today as well. So we'll do that first and then I'll come home and show you guys how everything is looking. We've lived at our apartment now for nearly a year, not quite, maybe like eight months, seven months. So everything's finally starting to come together, which makes me so happy. I still haven't got my side tables. That's like the last thing that I think I'll get done just because I haven't found any that I like. I do like these two, but they're on pre-order until May. Um, so I just don't know if I'll get those ones. So I'm gonna keep looking, but yeah, I just am really excited to show you guys the finished apartment so far. So we'll go do that tonight. I love my glam set. I recently went and bought a whole heap of new makeup products and I've changed my the way I do my makeup a little bit so I also feel like I need to show you guys my updated everyday makeup routine because yeah I've started like cream contouring and I really like how it looks and I don't do it pretty much oh Caitlin's here hi princess guys, like when you buy. oh guys Caitlin got a new bag oh no everything Maddie does I just like want to copy it okay <laughs> this is Caitlin's new Chanel bag thank you princess no so we got our coffee this is our old favorite cafe. I can say where we used to live. Yeah, you can now. We used to live in a suburb called Rosemary in Sydney, if anyone's wondering. It was really, really nice suburb. I, I would recommend it to other people. You didn't really like it so much. And <laughs> Caitlin had some bad experiences. I didn't love it. I really enjoyed it. But yeah, this is our favorite <laughs> cafe in Rosemary called Mentmore and Morley. Shout out to them. You guys They're have so to. Good. They are the sweetest people as well. They we remembered me when I was there. <gasps> Did they? Oh, I was like, oh. Stop. Yeah, they literally, when John used to go there and I'd be asleep, they'd say, they'd be like, is Maddie still sleeping when he'd oh, go get coffee? It's like, it's so cute. Anyways, we're off to the shoe now. It's called Sushi and Stanley. It's 
sushi on sushi Stanley Street. on Stanley Street in the city. It's so good. The plain udon. You guys have to try it if you come here. Honestly, it is the. I think it's the best udon. Yeah, and they're like so they do like little hacks. Like I like the tempura vegetarian yeah. hack, and you get so much. They give you like miso soup. It's like really all the rolls yeah. and. Like $14 for the whole thing. Yeah, it's so cheap. Chef's kiss indeed. Sushi and udon came. Look how good this looks. I'm telling you guys, you have to try this udon. Just got home, everyone, from lunch. That sushi was so good. But I wanted to give you guys the official apartment updates. So we just got our coffee table in. It looks amazing. I'm so happy with how this coffee table turned out. I feel like it completes the space so nicely and on top. I just put my coffee table book finally. I have wanted to put this book on the coffee table for such a long time now, so I'm so happy that it's finally has a home, even though it's also on the console table over there, but I'm just so happy with how it's all coming together. So as you guys can see, I think a bigger TV here would definitely work. Um, so I'm gonna go online shop and do that. And you guys will see that in an upcoming vlog, but I'm so happy with how everything has turned and come together. And I'm still so happy with how all of the pieces are looking in the apartment. So that coffee table over there is from N Gold. And this, if you guys are new here, our hallway table is from Bo Concept. I absolutely love it. I think it fits the space perfectly and it's such a nice sized hallway table. It actually has so much storage too. So I'm really, really happy with how that looked. Also, I put my book on it. Um, but yeah, I just love, love how this looks. The artwork as well, we got from an artist on Instagram called Expressions by Gina. If you guys are interested, I of course will leave links to everything in the description box down below. And then over here, like I said, our coffee table is from Ngold. Our couches, if you're new here, are from Crafted Furniture. The media unit is from Bro Concept as well. Honestly, such a good sized media unit and I love how this looks in the space. I think it will look so much better once we eventually have the bigger TV on it. I think it'll look even better. It's got so much storage too, which I love. We have all of like the Xbox controllers. And then also in here, I have a whole heap of different candles in here and like electronics and stuff in here too. So such a nice media console. If you guys are looking for any really nice furniture, I would definitely recommend Bow Concept. The bar cart as well, which I was so excited about. I actually got this in Noosa when I was out shopping with my mum and we both sp spotted it and I was just absolutely in love. We just put some glasses on it and a wine decanter and a few other things for cocktails. Really happy with how the space is coming together and I can't wait to see it once we have the really big TV. I think I'm not sure if I want to put stuff on this. I really like the minimal look. Um, I don't want to make it too messy on here. I think having a bigger TV will be enough. And then outside, I did get the outside table delivered. I just got it from Temple and Webster. I mentioned this in a previous vlog, but I'm still yet to build it just because I have not had the time and you have to literally build it from scratch, which is not my forte. I don't really like building furniture. I'm just so hopeless at it, but I think it'll look really nice. Once it is built, it really matches the couches as well. But yes, I'm so happy with how everything turned out. And also if you guys follow me on TikTok, I actually did post a, sorry, let me come over to the lighting. Um, If you guys follow me on TikTok, oh my gosh, my makeup. I'm gonna have to fix that up before tonight. But I did actually post a, TikTok vlog as well of the apartment tour. So make sure you guys follow me on TikTok. Um, but yeah, really happy with how this is all coming together. And the only thing left is to wait for the TV to arrive and then finish my room. I still need to hang up those paintings that fell down and get side tables, which is gonna be a mission, but that's to come. And then we can actually do the finished apartment tour. I know how invested you guys are in apartment things as much as I am. I love anything like homeware interior design. Right now I need to go do some work for the afternoon until I clock off. Friday afternoon, it's nearly time for me to finish and enjoy the rest of my night. Um, I think we're gonna go out after the dinner tonight, maybe. We'll see, we might go to a bar in the city called Smoke Bar. I don't know if I'll bring my actual camera out because it won't fit in my new bag. Oh! Duh, I didn't even show you guys my new bag. Yesterday I was a little bit naughty and I was actually in the city doing more content with my friends Kaylin and Nat and I went into Chanel and I had seen this bag before. I posted on my Instagram stories like a week ago and I asked you guys if I should get it and so many, so many of you guys said yes and I was going to wait until my birthday to buy it because obviously the Chanel bag is a very expensive piece and it's kind of an iconic moment for myself you know my first Chanel bag so I just wanted to wait for my birthday and make it special and yeah just have that special moment but 
when I went back in on the weekend, I just asked, I asked if it had been selling well and if she thinks it would still be there because it's actually a seasonal piece. This isn't the normal wallet chain wallet. Um, and she said that it was like the best seller and that she can't guarantee that it was going to be there. And I don't know if she's just saying that to make more money. She probably was, but she convinced me. I was like, ah, I need to buy it. So I went and bought my first ever Chanel bag. So this is my new bag i'm obsessed it's honestly the perfect size on me not too big not too small and i'm just so happy that i went for the um more brassy gold rather than the shiny one but i just i prefer the darker deeper gold i think it's more of a going to wear this out tonight with my outfit i think i'm so excited honestly this is such a surreal moment i had always dreamed about having my first ever chanel bag and yeah i just i can't believe it that i actually bought it for myself morning everyone happy sunday today um i didn't vlog at all yesterday because to be honest i was actually really hungover and i'm whispering right now because john is currently asleep i was actually so hungover yesterday we went out after the stacks event and we had a pretty late night so yeah i was literally just in bed all day yesterday we got uber eats it was kind of rainy yesterday so it was like the perfect hungover day and yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed a few days in my life. I'm just having my coffee now. And I'm super happy. Sunday morning. Easy Sunday morning. But anyways, that is everything for me. I'm going to have my coffee and get ready. Um, so I'm going to wrap this vlog up here. But I hope you guys have enjoyed it. And I will see you in my next one.